वेलकम टू दर एपिसोड ऑफ होम कुकिंग टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू डू समथिंग डिफरेंट समथिंग डिफरेंट ऑन द ग्रिल बट इट्स अ फिश इट्स टोटली इट्स अ फिश आइटम टूडे सो आई ऑलरेडी मैरिनेट द फिश आई गोइंग टू शो यू इट इज मैरिनेटेड फॉर टू थ्री आवर्स राइट नाउ क्लीन द फिश यू कैन यूज एनी फिश टूडे आई यूज लाइक अ पंपैनो विच इज पॉम्पलेट or like uh, uh in india is called vetki which is a uh, sea bass so those are used and also shrimp so i'm going to show you what i did this is a combination this is the combination of pompano and sea bass so this is already marinated I... so this is a uh, mar- this is marinated 2 3 hours back uh, everything cleaned sea bass and uh, pompano uh, yellow pompano it will be taste we're going to bake it uh, some oil uh salt cumin chili powder coriander powder and then some garam masala if you want you can put some of those and then little bit of to make the color you can use little bit of uh, you know uh, tandoori tandoori powder so that will give you the color so use that and of course you have to add some yogurt and some oil and a couple of lime so that's mixed together everything is there keep in a refrigerator for 2 to 3 hours and then it's ready right now for baking uh today we're going to do grilling though so let's go outside grill is ready we're going to do it we're going to show. okay so we are outside on the deck back side of the house ready with the grill the grill temperature is already 40 uh, 400 fahrenheit so that's ready i am not using the whole grill because it's not that too much of food so i am using one side of the grill. so what i'm going to do since this is the fish we can do directly on the grill or you can put uh, what i'm going to do i'm going to put aluminum foil for today so since it is heated up what i'm going to do i'm going to use some canola oil sprayed on it so spray it so everything will stay and it was flying also now it's not going to fly and start putting the fish i start with the big one we'll put both the fish you know pompano and sea bass it will all go together now i'll show you how to do i have some head also the head is still is good also you know you can use the head too So now I put all the fish, the big fish, on the lower shelf of the grill. And what I'm going to do this uh, this marinated spice, I'm going to put it on it. I'm going to use it as I'm going to spread it as it goes. So that will give a more you know tasty part of this fish. So this is done. Uh, I'm going to use it slowly. it will cook in at, at low and the next interesting part is i'm going to put the shrimp on the top to do that just take the shrimp and put it directly over here so this will be less heat on the top but the shrimp will be ready you know it will faster So I'm putting the shrimp here. This is our Gulf shrimp. This came from Gulf, and it's really tasty. I am not going to peel the shrimp. I didn't peel the shrimp. I used the whole shrimp. What I did, I just cut the head a little bit with that sharp edge. I cut that part, and then I used the whole thing. I didn't take it off. That's Uh, anything off from there because if it is small you can put it down because it may fall so now everything is on the grill the shrimp on the top uh, there are a couple of excess because i only using these two burner and couple of those in the on the bottom but everything will be cooking uh, you have you are hearing this sizzling sound put it on low cover it every 5 to 10 minutes uh, every 5 minutes i should say not go 10 minutes and then check and you may have to you know put it upside down so we 
So now it's almost five to six minutes. So what you have to do, you have to just see. The color has been changed for the shrimps. It's become red. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to just, you know, make it upside down. And then before that, I'm going to spray some of this oil here, this canola oil for all of these. So if you, I get some oil before a little bit. So if you get some oil, this will, you know, keep it moist a little bit. And this is the canola oil. You can use any canola oil. So let's start from here. See, it is it's cooking. Let's start, and you'll get all the fire coming up slowly, slowly. I'm going to put this up. And once I make upside down, I'm going to put some more spices that I have, the marination that I have on it. I'm still doing it in a low heat. The low heat for grill is high. It's too much. It's also a little bit high. So you have to be careful. So everything is, you know, upside down right now. So I'm going to add some of these spices that gray, uh, that uh, marinated what I have in my bowl. So it will go good inside. You know? What I did, I pulled this whole uh, aluminum foil a little bit in the front so you can handle good and get some air. I'm going to do that and then the shrimp wise, you can take the shrimp also upside down. Uh, you don't need to do all because it's take, it don't need much heat. You know? So it's happening in low heat. If it falls down, it falls down below, and which is good. It will capture it, it will not go west inside the burner. So the shrimps are upside down, and I'm going to do is I'm going to use this uh, marinated leftover on it so it will go good in it. And then I'll cover it, keep it another five to six minutes uh, in that range. So I'm going to use all of these marinated leftover spices on this. You can use the brush, I'm okay with the spoon. So let's wait for another 5 to 6 minutes. So we are almost done here, it's almost 20 minutes to 25 minutes, see? Everything is almost done. The fish are coming off from their bones, shrimp are done on the top and you will see that everything is sizzling it get all the water out so what i'm going to do right now you know i'm going to put off one oven the one on the end over here i put it off keep this one in low and then uh keep it here and you try as it goes so right now i'm going to try one fish here i'm going to show you how it cooked and how it tastes so that's the plan here I'll get one of each, okay? And then some small pieces are there. You should take it fast because otherwise. So I'll just keep it like this. This this is shut off. This is low. It will stay good. And then you can enjoy. So this is done. I'm going to show you how this is done. How, uh, how well this is done. Uh, so shrimp is done. This is one of the one of the big fish. So what I'm going to do, take this fish and see, it's coming off, it's coming off of the bone. See, it's done. See, this is done. So this is baked. So let's give it a try, how it tastes. You have all the spices, it's hot, be careful. Mm, I have some salad here if you want. It's too, it's too hot. So yeah. So this is all done. Hmm. Done great. I like some red onion, some Indian chili. Great. The good about this shrimp, the head is intact. You can have this. The brain material of the head is good.
Really good. See? You can eat the whole shell or like this. I eat like this. The whole shell. Simple, made at home, good food, enjoy for the weekend. So, friends, we come back to the new episode with some new ideas of home cooking, home grilling. Until now, goodbye. Enjoy the food. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.